Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Here's a question asked by one of you, whether you emailed it to me, chris at perillo.com. You posted it to lockerdome.net, possibly to ask the question on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, or somewhere in the mix. Either way, how can you tell if someone's using your Wi-Fi? I'm going to give you a couple seconds to answer that question yourself because I'm sure you're going to comment before listening to my answer. The bottom line is, well, you, you got to look at what your router or access point says because it will show you in real time which devices are connected to that access point or that router in general. Whether they're showing up with their Mac ID or their Mac address or they're showing, and that's not Mac as in Mac versus PC, it's uh, machine access code. Every device that has network uh, compatibility has this. It's a hexadecimal string of 10 digits. Uh, so it would be, what would it be? Zero through, or one through zero, or zero through nine, and A, B, C, D, E, F. Uh, and, and these strings of characters would show that machine's ID. Or the DHCP ID, the network ID that you may have defined uh, somewhere either in Windows, Mac OS X, or Linux. And you'll see exactly who's there. And if you notice something like, wait a minute, I don't know that ID, uh, that's possibly something I need to lock down. And in many cases, once you know that ID, you can go through and you can define in most routers or access points exactly which IDs can connect to that access point. You essentially whitelist uh, any of the machines, any of the devices that are connected uh, to your network. And with that, uh, you'll know exactly what's connected and what's not, what's potentially uh, drawing more data uh, than others, depending, of course, on uh, your uh, your router or access point and its software. And, uh, you know, if you don't have the ability to view that information, then maybe time to upgrade your access point. Uh, of course, the bottom line, you should always lock down your access point if you can. Uh, at this point, WPA2, it, it, yes, it can be cracked, uh, but the chances of that happening are, I wouldn't say incredibly as large as, you know, say, having an open access point and people jumping on your network willy-nilly. That's how you find out whether someone is using your Wi-Fi. Of course, you could also ask them. I guess it's a roundabout way of, a more direct way of doing the round. It's a good question, and hopefully I answered it sufficiently. Uh, I think that's about it. We'll see you later.